Well, this is what they've been striving for, and shortly it will become reality. Here in the Spanish capital, it's the UEFA Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined for commentary tonight by Lee Dixon, and we're fast approaching kickoff time here at the Estadio Metropolitano. It's Barcelona facing Borussia Dortmund. Well, we started with 32 teams, Derek. Seems like an eternity ago. Now we're down to the best two. I've not played in the Champions League final. I surely wish I was playing tonight. Turn the clock back and let me run out there, please. I mean, let's face it, when Messi is on the pitch, you cannot take your eyes off him. What do you think he'll offer in this match, Lee? Well, his ability on the ball is second to none. Just watch how close he keeps the ball to his feet. He lures defenders in. Then quick turn of pace and he's away from you. Brilliant player. to the triumphs over Manchester United 2009 and again in 2011 Lee. Well the power of wearing that shirt can almost put you a goal up and in the final they'll use that Barcelona, they'll use their name, they'll use the aura around this club to try and force the game a little bit in the final. I'm pretty sure there'll be a force to be reckoned with. This is what we expect from the Blagrana. Marc-Andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Pique starts alongside Clément Langlais in the centre of defence. Arthur plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And Luis Suarez will be the main striker here. And introducing the Borussia Dortmund side, Roman Burki gets the nod in goal. Mats Hummel starts alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence. Julian Brandt plays alongside Axel Witzel in central midfield. And as for the attack, well, it has a bold look about it with three forwards listed from the beginning. And they're underway now in the Champions League final. We're about to find out which team is the best in Europe. Now Busquets... Individual quality coming to the fore. Sergio Roberto. Artur. Sergio Roberto. And that's an important intervention. Longley. Now Busquets. Busquets. And just as well from the defensive point of view that he was able to make that interception. Well, Barcelona always fully expect to be at the business end of the UEFA Champions League, but that doesn't mean that the group stage games don't have their own magic league. No, they don't. And every time this team takes to the pitch, there's something special normally happens, whether it's an individual or a team effort. They really are a special Spanish club. Well, that was close to free kick perfection, Lee. Yeah, just didn't quite get enough dip on it, did he? Over the wall, but just over the bar as well. Sergio Roberto. Artur has it. Messi. Artur. Messi. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Messi. And cleared behind for what is going to be a corner kick. And he's fired over the corner. Punching it clear. Happy to take on the shot. And the 
Keeper's given it away inexcusably. Sancho now. It's with Guerrero. And Witzel with it. And he was in the right place to intercept. Lionel Messi. Now Griezmann. Jordi Alba. He has time to play it over. Busquets. Artur. Wonderful block. Sergio Busquets. Good ball movement and a decent position here for Barcelona. And a very good challenge. And very deftly cut out. Busquets. Now Busquets. Artur. De Jong. Possession changes hands. The interception there. It's with Guerrero. Witzel. They might be able to get in now. Hakimi. Excellent challenge. And that's gone out of play for what will be a goal kick. Now Busquets. Artur. Sergio Roberto. Making progress. Real chance. Opportunity, maybe. A goal for Barcelona. The Blaugrana out in front in the Champions League final. So how important will that be for Barcelona to get their noses in front? That remains to be seen. Well, Derek gives a good delivery into the box, but you have to question the defending there. They simply don't react quickly enough. A chance to revisit the goal. The game has restarted, and it's Barcelona in front. The ball with Marco Reus. Has plenty of know-how in the ball-shielding department. Top-class defending. Artur. Suarez. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. On the ball, Luis Suarez. Messi. Sergio Busquets. Lionel Messi. Promising avenue of attack favoured by Messi. De Jong. And a wild, wild attempt from long range. Not one for his highlight reel. Well, it's a poor choice. He's got other options on. Why is he shooting from that distance? Trailing as they are. What will be the thinking in the camp as you see it, Lee? Well, Dortmund are definitely still in this game. Such fine margins between success and failure at this level. They need to stick to the game plan, maybe put a bit more pressure on the opposition in the second half. Get the ball in the... Shot attempted. Good stop from the keeper. And a Dortmund corner here. And over comes the corner. Sancho. Guerrero. Manuel Akanji. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. This attack looks highly promising. Suarez!
Sancho now. And there's the whistle. Half time it is. A radiant Champions League final up to this point, Lee. Well, nervous, cagey, boring. Not so this final. This has been a really entertaining game so far. Looking forward to more of the same in this. And they're. Into the second half, then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Couldn't hang on to it. Frankie de Jong. And it was read so beautifully by Hummels. Barcelona, free kick. It'll be here. Lacked a bit of conviction and straight into the wall. PK. Messi. Staunch rear guard action. Jaden Sancho. Hakimi. Borussia Dortmund have given it away. A highly purposeful attack, this. The emphasis on getting the ball forward. Passing it with a bit of panache. Marco Reus. Strong play here on the shielding front. Going well. Strongly in, PK. Reus. He takes aim. To sting him with a great save. corner played into the box not all that convincing defensively alert defending read it magnificently and intercepted Royce into the advanced position Frankie de Jong and we're inside the final 30 minutes. Giving the ball away. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Suarez. Frankie de Jong. Sergio Busquets. Suarez. It's opening up for them. Now Busquets. Jordi Alba Sergio Busquets De Jong Excellent passing A wonderful intervention Well a sloppy clearance What can the opposition do with this? De Jong Messi Barca maintain possession Messi Clean challenge. Good thing from his point of view. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Whipped in by Griezmann. And they deal with the threat this time. Well, the shot from that position left a bit to be desired. You've just got to hit the target. Let the power down a little bit and go for accuracy. They've regained possession. Hazard. It's with Mats Hummers. Sancho now. Keeping the ball moving. Firing it in. Simple four to Stegen. 
Well, just look at the stats up there. They really haven't created enough. Not tested the goalkeeper, not tested the defence. Mind you, only takes one little mistake and they could get back into this game. Brandt with it. Vidal. Messi. Arturo Vidal. Delightful pass. Chance for Sergio Roberto. Well, it might still work out for them. Possession changes hands. The interception there. Lionel Messi! De Jong just cutting off the supply. He's in control of the situation. Hakimi. Hakimi in full control of the ball here. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Sergio Busquets. Suarez with their noses in front in the second half. What will be the thinking in the camp, Lee Dixon? Barcelona players have to stay focused on not making any mistakes in order to protect this slender lead. If a bit of magic from the opposition gets them back in it, there's little you can do about that. Just a couple of minutes left for play. Barca making progress. What can they do from this position? And the shot decidedly lacking accuracy. Well, he had other options as well, but he chose to shoot. They will now make use of the substitute's bench. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. Borussia Dortmund have given it away. Sergio Busquets. Barcelona moving the ball swiftly and finding themselves in a promising position. Now Busquets. Vidal. He succeeds in clearing it. And up for grabs off the keeper. And the final whistle, the cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter how much money you've got in the bank. Players will always look back at moments like these. These moments where you pick trophies up and win medals. Absolutely brilliant for this group of players. Yep, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. And as a player, Lee, as a Barcelona player in this case, this is what you want to experience. Well, it is. You have expectations at the start of the season, all those long, hard training sessions in pre-season. You kind of need a goal to get through that pain focusing on winning trophies for Barcelona will be that carrot that they need. It's Barcelona's Champions League! And they've got to savour this. It's not every night this comes along. Well, it probably will be here next year, you never know. <laughs> the way they play, but fully deserved, and they'll have uh, celebrations right throughout the night with their families and friends. The cup with the big ears, as it's affectionately known. And this is the moment, Derek, sharing it with the supporters. You get a chance to take it a little bit closer to those stands, let them enjoy the experience with you, and the families are up there in the stands as well. A brilliant occasion. It took fire as well as ice on the pitch. Necessary qualities. Well, they've come together in this competition as a team and they're celebrating together now, fully deserved. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe. 